What's going on, Champagne Gang? Fizz fam, confidants. <laughs> Welcome to the Champagne City for Sit, Savor, and Speak. I think I'm going to create a spot specifically for those confidants of mine who like dipping into the creativity. I think I'm going to call it Let's Get Creative. And it'll be a spot specifically for those who want to learn how to do thumbnails and video editing, transitions, effects, filters, all that fun stuff. Y'all know my motto. I learn something, I create something. So since I'm learning and creating, I might as well teach you while I'm at it, right? So the purpose for this video, for many of you who know, all of the videos that you see, the editing and everything else is done by me. One of the programs that I use is Wondershare Filmora. Another program that I use is Canva. But for the purpose of this video, we're only discussing Wondershare Filmora. And the reason we're discussing Wondershare today is because there's been some changes. And I'm not happy about it. I'm not happy at all. So one of the reasons why I chose Wondershare was because I could get everything that I needed all in one place. Stock media, audio, effects, transitions, filters, templates. I could get everything that I needed. And what I couldn't find, I was able to go over to Canva and import it. But now, as of a few days ago, something has changed. Yeah, again, I don't like it. So let me tell you what that change is. Well, as you're looking at the screen, what you're looking at is a blank workspace for Wondershare Filmora. This is what you would see if you opened up a blank workspace to begin working. What you had access to, and get it, I said had, was stock media, audio, titles, transitions, effects, filters, stickers, templates, right? All of the things that you need to make your video pop, make it exciting, and make it fun. As of a few days ago, some things have changed changed. So if you look on the left hand side, you see project media, global media, cloud media, influence kit, adjustment layer, compound clip, right? Now if I click on the stock media tab, then I get mine, AI, I get library. Now inside the library, this is where you get the gradients and the trending and the stuff that everyone is kind of using. But you also get something called partners. Now underneath partners, you see Pexels, Giphy, Pixabay, Unsplash. These were items that we were able to use with our subscription to give our videos that extra touch of pizzazz. All we had to do was click on the partner we wanted. Now I generally went to Giphy because Giphy has more of the fun gifts that you can use and we were able to use them. There were free items and some that you had to pay for, but there was still enough free assets that you didn't have to worry about paying for another subscription to get what you needed. Now, when you click on it, the partner, the question mark, it says you will be redirected to a third party that has nothing to do with Wondershare and to abide by their rules. Say what? So you just woke up and chose violent Wondershare. You just woke up and said, today I'm going to disrupt everyone's life and video production time because what? Why is this a problem? Well, number two, we didn't know it was going to happen. But number one, it was done in the middle of paid subscriptions. So something we once had access to through our subscription we no longer do but you didn't change the price for it though that's my problem price is still the same so unfortunately and I hate it because I'm one of those that when I get comfortable with something I don't like changing it but unfortunately I'm going to have to find another editing program that offers everything in one place which is the reason I chose Wondershare in the first place so if any of my fizz fam have any program suggestions that are comparable to Wondershare drag and drop easy peasy cheesy and doesn't require a degree in rocket science to figure out because that's how I feel right now trying to learn animation I do please drop in the comments and let me know or reach out to me at champagnesecrets at gmail.com so if you're wondering what happened to your stock media like I was that's what happened and I spoke with Wondershare to confirm it so till next time keep those creative juices flowing see you soon